Hi everyone, it's Dawn, and I hope you're having a fantastic day. Well, I need to apologize to some people. First of all, Cruising with Josh, ECCE Travels, uh, Tony and Jenny from La Vida Loca, and Sharon at Seas for including me and uh, treating me um, so well on that cruise. It was great meeting them, such a great bunch of people, had a great time with them, um, and meeting all the, the people that were there for the, for, to see the vloggers on the cruise. We, I think they did a pretty darn good job for the first ever attempt at something this large. I mean, 900 people on board um, is, is no small feat to try and organize things. So well done by them. Uh, and then second of all, uh, I got sick on this cruise. It started to happen on Paradise Beach where I just started losing my appetite. I wasn't, you know, coughing or anything like that. I wasn't spewing anything or anything like that it was just I just I wasn't hungry and I mean all, we had everyone's raving about the food there and having such a good time and I just I just I could not uh, I just was not hungry at all so um, then the next morning hit and we had to get up around 6 30 in the morning we had a photo op at seven o'clock and then we had the last uh, Q&A meeting at nine o'clock and I woke up and I was not feeling very well. I was queasy, uh, my stomach was turning. Um, again, wasn't coughing, wasn't doing anything like that, didn't have a fever, but I was feeling a little dizzy. Um, so I think I got a little bit of food poisoning uh, somewhere. Um, not saying it's a ship. It could have been at a cruise port. It could have been something I ate on my own. Uh, it could have been anything. But um, I, I managed to get through the two of the <laughs> the sessions, the photo op and the um, Q and A. And then I returned to my room, and I had some other things planned. Uh, very nice people invited me to Cagney's that night at six. I'm afraid I was in my room from the moment I left the the Q and A, um, and most of that time was in the small room in my room. If you get my picture of where I was, and it wasn't coming out this way, it was coming out another way. But it was coming out bad, and I have to fly the next day, so I was kind of worried about that. And I couldn't even get out and say goodbye to my friends on board. I, luckily, I didn't see some of them on the way out when we were checking out and walking out with the luggage and that. Um, but I was disappointed I couldn't spend the last night out there mingling with everybody. So I just wanted to apologize for that. I really I wasn't doing well and I didn't want to make anybody... Once I started feeling to the point where I was sick sick, I didn't want to take a chance and maybe give it to somebody else or anything like that. And so I flew back yesterday. <laughs> Best news ever, my flights weren't delayed and all the flights around me were delayed coming because we had a big snowstorm here in Ottawa. But my flight still arrived on time, but I was drinking this thing. 899 airport, <laughs> Pepto-Bismol, um, to keep everything down and just the turbulence and that in the airplane did not do my stomach very well yesterday. Um, but then I landed in the airport and I got my luggage and Angelina called me on the phone because we had a bit of an emergency. There was a final payment due and she had been trying all day and for some reason the computer, her computer, it wasn't accepting the final payment date for this couple and it was a 5 p.m. deadline. I arrived around 7.30 there. But we have two accounts because she's works under me, but I have my main account. So I was trying to answer the phone with Angelina and I was trying to pay for my parking to go and not also be sick. <laughs> and a very nice gentleman came up and said, hi, uh, we were on your cruise 
And I don't know if he was, you know, he was with his wife and I think two, two kids. And I was kind of in a hurry. I tried to spend some time, but I really felt bad that I couldn't just stop what I was doing and talk. Because if you've met me on the cruise, I absolutely did. Um, every chance I got, I spent as much time with everybody as I possibly could. So I felt so bad last night when I was kind of on the phone in speaker phone one, trying to pay with a credit card another. And this gentleman was so nice just coming up and say hi here in Ottawa. So if you're listening out there, I want to apologize. I really, I hope I didn't seem curt or anything like that because uh, um, I, did, I wasn't doing well and I was kind of, and he looked like he completely understood. So don't get me wrong. It's not like I said, hey, get out of here or anything like that. I did talk to him for a little bit. And, uh, but I, I just, nor normally I would have stood there for 10, 15 minutes, 20 minutes and, and chatted. So I felt, I did feel bad about that. Just like I felt bad that I couldn't go to Cagney's with the, the people who invited me um, to dinner that night. So I just want to apologize for anybody that I was looking, didn't, didn't get to see on the cruise. I tried to be, I was at all the shows. I saw a couple of the shows twice. I was in the Magic Act. I was out in O'Shea's. I went to Paradise Beach, I did the sloth tours with people, I walked around port, so I was out and about, but it is a big ship, and sometimes you're just not going to catch people when they're out there. But as you can see, I'm in my robe today. I said I gotta get up because I don't know how long I can stay up and do anything. I'm just going to try and take a hot shower again this morning clear up things, some things, have some dry toast. I still have not eaten, it's been three days, haven't had a drop of food yet uh, because it just comes out right now. I do have some medicine and I do have that here at home. So don't worry about that kind of stuff. I'll be looked after and my family's nearby and I'm a big boy. Um, but I, I had to come on and just say, um, again, uh, to those people who I ran into, excuse me, at the airport, uh, I hope I didn't seem rude. I really do. Um, I don't think I did, but just in case I wanted to get that out there. And the folks looking for me in Cagney's, again, sorry. And I hope all my interactions out there on the cruise ship, I hope you guys had a great time because I know I did. And I hope I'm invited back when they decide to do a Vlogger Cruise 2.0, if you will. I think that will be in a couple years, and I, I would highly recommend it. Um, because I think it will only get bigger and better from here on in. I think they did a pretty darn good job. Um, yeah, it's not fun when you get sick and you don't know why. But I think I put on a little bit of a brave face. But I look pretty horrible today. So tomorrow, I hope I'm all better. And uh, back to the regular news show, but I just, I this was aching in my head all night last night that I couldn't sleep because thinking that, oh, I disappointed people. And I, I hate more than anything disappointing people. So um, yeah, that's my, uh, my little apology video.